Hey everyone, this is Steve from Metaslider, which is the best way to create powerful slideshows for your WordPress site. In this video, I'm going to talk about captions, which is adding text on top of the images inside your slideshow. Let's see how this works. I have a WordPress website with the free version of Metaslider installed. This is the version that you can grab on wordpress.org right now. And I'm going to go to Metaslider and the quick start option. This allows me to choose from some demos that are already created. I'm going to choose the image slideshow option here. I'll click on the create a slideshow link and I'm going to get provided with some sample images so I can get working on my slideshow immediately. There we go. We have one, two, three, four different images ready to use here. If you look in the middle, you'll see the caption area. You have the choice between a media caption a media description, and a manual entry. The media caption and the media description are pulled directly from the WordPress media library. If you go to media and the library area, you'll be able to see some of the images in the slideshow. I'm going to choose the first image that we have in our slideshow. And on the right side, you'll see the caption and description area. I'm going to enter a little bit of text so we can see how this works. I'll close that and then go back to my slideshow and refresh the screen. And now the media caption is being pulled in automatically. This is going to work as a caption. The media description can also be pulled in automatically. You can choose to use one of those two or you can choose the menu entry for the caption. Uh, we have what appears to be a photo of a beach house here. So let's say this is my beach house. And you'll see formatting options up at the top. You can add bold, italic, colors, and other options to your text. I'm going to save this, and I'm going to see what it looks like on the front of the site. You can scroll down to the bottom of the right sidebar and choose the short code. This is perfect for page builders and other ways that don't use the block editor in WordPress. But we are going to use the Gutenberg block editor for this example. I'll go to posts, add new post. And I'm going to put caption slideshow as the title of the post. I'm going to choose the meta slider block. I'll choose my slideshow and we get a little preview here of what the slideshow looks like. The first of these has a caption. I will publish this and view the slideshow on the front of the site. This is how captions work in default in Metaslider. I'm going to go back to the admin area. I'll go to Metaslider and edit new slideshow. And I'm going to add a caption to these other images as well. This is a photo of some healthy vegetables from my garden. This is a beach near me at night. And this is an old camera I have. Okay, so we can save this, and when we go back to the front of the site, we can browse through the slideshow and see each of these images has a caption underneath it. You've seen how you can control the formatting of these captions. You can add bold, italic, text, color, and more to these captions. Let me add some bold there, a little italic, and perhaps a little color as well. You can also add links. You can add CSS. You can add alignment. And if I refresh the slideshow on the front of the site, we can see all of those in action there. If you do want to control the placement of these captions, you do that by changing the theme. I'll go back to the admin area. 
And on the right side, I'm going to choose a new theme. For example, I'm going to choose this Simply Dark theme here. I'll select Simply Dark. Metaslider will save my slideshow automatically. And if I refresh the front of the site, we see that the caption has moved slightly. It's now off the bottom, and it's a little clearer and perhaps easier to read there. I'll go back to the admin area, and I'll replace Simply Dark, this time with the disjoint theme here. I'll click on Select, and I'll see what this looks like on the front of the site. Now the caption is much higher up, and it's centered as well. In this case, there might be room to change the caption to perhaps an H2 or H3 heading. There's room to make this caption much larger. We can keep on cycling through the different themes. I'll go down here and I'll choose the highway theme this time. And now the caption has moved to the middle left. So there are lots of themes available with Metaslider, and if you use the pro version, you can create your own and customize the themes. But the theme is what controls where the caption appears on your slideshow. So it really is quick and easy to add text to the images in your WordPress slideshow. You can do this with the free version, which really is full of lots of powerful features like this. And it's completely free and available for you to download right now from wordpress.org. So if you haven't done so yet, go ahead and give Metaslider a try. It's the best way to create powerful slideshows for your WordPress website.